make things from such a small place. Don't think about such things. Why not? You'll be disappointed. It's an unlikely setting for a Disney fairy tale. But Katwe Slum in Kampala is where Ugandan chess prodigy Fiona Mutesi was born. And it's here that the film Queen of Katwe, based on her life story, was made. Fiona's brother Brian explains what life was like for them growing up here. The landlord could come and knock. I wanted, we, she, she wanted money, and we never had that such money. This is the man behind Fiona's success. Robert Katende gave up a career in engineering to teach the children in this slum how to play chess. Katende believes that the discipline and strategy he teaches through chess help his students cope with the many challenges they face. Fiona arrived at his club by chance. Like some of the other children at the academy, she was homeless and living on the streets of Katwe. What really was so captivating on my side is the hard determination to survive as a young girl. Because it's rare to find girls in, uh, in the slum. They are always timid uh, because of the environment. They are so marginalized, so they don't think they can do anything. But she, uh, she's one young girl who was determined to survive for her cause. As the film premiered in Kampala, Robert and Fiona are side by side on the red carpet. For Fiona, the film has been life changing. There are a lot of things that I've never experienced, like the red carpet and the audience was so huge and also. It was too much than the movie. My first time to watch it was, it was so emotional. Like, I couldn't believe it. Yeah. As the real Queen of Katwe returns to normal life, her incredible story will continue to travel the world.